somebody call a doctor because bad medicine is back. That's the Appleton Oak. I'm Mason Quinn. Folks, today we are diving back into the survival horror game. That is The Quarry. This one has been so much fun for us and... I dare say, I think our skills are getting a little bit better. Little bit, little <laughs> bit. Let's go! Oh, yeah. There's our card. Oh, back at the cabin. Yep. Oh, dude's about to turn into a monster. This will open the nurse's station. Should be plenty of stuff in there. Yep, well, hopefully we can just get him cleaned yeah. up for now. I'll get you something neat. You and I are going to find a landline. Oh, uh, yeah. Um, isn't there one in Mr. H's office? Yep. Mm -hmm. We'll come meet you. Copy that. Same place for all them cameras are. Uh, is this your guy or? Yeah, this is your guy. Oh, okay. Uh, I'll be optimistic. I really hope they're going to be okay. Do you think that whatever's left in the nurse's office <laughs> is going to cut it? Nope. Caitlin knows what she's doing. Does she? I, I mean, she wasn't even supposed to be working at the nurse's office this summer. She only filled in because some other girl didn't show up. It's better than nothing. <sighs> Come on, let's go call for backup. It's pretty weird to see this place so dead. You never came down here at night while camp was in session? What? No, did you? A couple times, yeah. Big old dining hall. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> Where are you going? I, 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 I thought I just heard my name. I didn't hear anything. You did, and but, he did. Like if if I said that to you, what would you think? Uh, He'd be like, I don't know. you're not going over there. He thought you heard somebody say your name. What's oh, that was the, the big mistake we made. In <laughs> yeah, until the injuries are as bad as we thought. Well, let's be hopeful. I'm not well, sure. That's good news. Yeah. So what now? Is he healing up too fast? Uh, we gotta call for help. Who should I call? Uh, Mr. H? He ain't coming The back. only number I got is to this phone. Okay, then 911. You mean 911? Who says 911? <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. Uh, anyway, that's yeah. A good point. But, like, what should I ask for? Like, police? Ambulance? Huh. Both? Both? Maybe, yeah, do we have to be specific? Just get somebody. I'll be curious. Well, do you need to specifically ask for an ambulance, or can you just say, like, help, help? So they'll say, 911, what's your emergency? And I'll just call. Say, help, help, Jeez, help. guys. My friend may have been attacked by a bear, or maybe not a bear, but definitely an animal with teeth. And we're not sure how many there are out there right oh now. Oh, my God. And, Dude, and seriously? How smart they are. Maybe so I should have just said, call the right cops. Now. So just, like, send a whole bunch of ambulances just to be sure. Yeah, yeah, that's that's good. <laughs> okay. Sorry, folks. We'll try not to talk over the dialogue yeah. here. It's just... <laughs> What's wrong? Dead. What? Are you sure you didn't hang it up? I heard him say the 911. Well, did you hang up? How could I have hung up? <laughs> I don't know. You know, maybe you slipped and hung up or something. Do you know how phones work? Yeah, of course. Real phones, not cell phones? Do you know how phones work? We heard it say, hello, 911. Okay, well, you broke. I did not. Oh, there's oh. one in the back office. So this phone's a no-go. The old cut in the phone no line. No, is there anywhere else in the camp that has a landline? Yep, in the creepy surveillance well, not room. a landline. What? The radio hut has some old broadcast gear. Where, where you do your announcements? Where I curate my sweet summer jams, yeah, and where I do the PA announcements. It has some old equipment there. I think we could probably... Break something up and get a message out. <laughs> Feels all like right. until yeah. dawn, all let's, over. Let's head over there and see if we can contact somebody. Put that back, Dylan. 
put that back. What are you crazy? Well, exactly. What do you in that situation? You gotta say you're crazy. Yeah, I'd be like, are you, you gotta be fucking crazy if you think I'm gonna go out there without something to defend right. myself. Right. It's more of a safety concern. Oh, oh my do you think God. I'm gonna shoot my eye out <laughs> or your whole head? Ralphy. Don't be a dick, man. I know how to use this. I understand. Not everybody <laughs> okay. likes. Uh, it's it's probably the weather. What weather, Ryan? It's Ryan Maybe on it. Maybe it was the bears. Bear. And why does everyone blame everything on bears? Okay. So for the sake of argument, what if that bear that uh, cut our phone line and just cut out all the power, what if that bear is waiting for us out in the hallway? Fair point. Thank you. <laughs> we should probably tell Caitlin that we're going to the radio hut. They're probably freaks. Yeah, okay. Yeah, let's go. Oh, taking the deep breath. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, we should not, leave that with Caitlin. Oh, no. she, swinging it right at him. Not how you clear a room, but. <laughs> uh, uh, does she. Uh, give her yours, yeah. yeah. Somebody needs it. So somebody needs it. Well, maybe we should just leave her with your gun. I'm a much better shot than you. You don't know that, okay? I might be an amazing shot. As long as you have one between the two of you. Each group I might has be. One. Just give her your gun. <sighs> ah, whatever. I'll give it. As long yeah. as somebody has it. Uh, all right. You're right. Hey, so well, both groups. Still have mine. If you're extra nice to me, I'll, I might let you hold it. Don't write a check that your ass can't cash. My ass has got quite the bank account. <laughs> I haven't heard that comeback for it. Uh, no. Well, he appreciates your decision. And I interrupted something? Uh, you haven't noticed we don't have any power? No, I'm not interrupting anything. Chin up, big guy. It, I wouldn't really know what to do with it, okay? I trust you. Oh, thank you so much, Dylan. You're so generous and handsome. Yeah, no problem. Don't mention it. <laughs> Emma, Ooh, Emma, this is me. That is you. <clears throat> oh, with the music, I wanted to get the... The <laughs> control! <laughs> The guy, you barely did anything. I was nervous. The controller. It's not sweaty, but it is noticeably warm, ladies and gentlemen. I have a, I have a high BTU output. Uh, was it like last time, though? Yesterday, I got this. Or not yesterday. Last time we played, I got this thing handed off to me. It was sweaty, sweaty. All right. If we get it. Yeah. Oh, do I get the zip line here? Seems like. Uh, we're gonna real. Why would you go slow? Yeah, it we're gonna do it noise. quickly. I know it makes no noise, yeah. but we just got to get it over there. Oh boy. Okay, here we go. Uh, there it is. Get on the zip line. Uh, reel it in. Jump. I gotta jump for it. I'm jumping for the zip line, right? No, you're jumping in the water. Oh no, you are. Okay, that's an easy. Uh... Okay. I, I thought maybe they thought you were jumping in the water. That'd be a high fall into the water, yeah. especially given we don't know how shallow it is. Oh, she jumped. Is that thing, that wild thing can probably swim. Yeah, they showed that before. Oh, don't scratch your nose, Oak. <laughs> <laughs> Get you with the QTEs. Oh, uh, taser's done. Still got the bear spray though, right? Well, we saved her. I think we're doing pretty good. Yeah, for now we saved her. Oh, back here again. Back here. Already. Oh, good to see you. Good to see you. <sighs> A time again, is it? Apparently. 
strength. Hmm. Strength can be surprising. Knowing one's own raw you power, see a card that's tapping spreading. into it, mm -hmm. tapping into a previously unknown energy. I suppose there are forces that work within us all, and with one hand it gives, and with the other it could rip away. As always, there's more to see, and as always, the choice is yours. Would you like to see more? Clearly, we would love to see more. Yeah, we gotta see more. See more, yeah. Why would we just want to move on and skip? That, that'd that be kind of strange. Folks, let us know. Well... Okay, okay. Oh, somebody's getting gnawed on. Oh, it looks like that's... Yeah, he did turn. Is that Nick? So it's goodbye it looked like it was again. Nick handling the guy I'll out with the with coveralls. Remember yeah. who your friends are. Remember who's looking out for you. Remember who your friends are. Yeah. Okay, so don't play selfishly. Is that maybe the... Well, and remember who you're kind of tight with and who's trying to knife you in the back, maybe. Oh boy. Chapter 5, White Noise. We don't need to see my reward here. Nick. Okay, this is also me. Aussie Nick. Hey, I couldn't find anything to eat. The kitchen's pretty cleaned out. Oh shoot, I left my bag. I I brought you this. That was fuck. I don't even know what happened. It was all just a blur. How are you feeling? Grateful, compassionate, well, compassionate. How are you holding up? I'm, uh, well, I, I, I'm just happy you're okay. Are you okay? <laughs> I'm sorry, I, I just asked you that. I... It's okay. All right, they're off to find a radio or something. What's with the, um, the... Oh, uh, we found another in Mr. H's office, so, just in case. Oh, what happened to the lights? Not sure. A bear. Any better? I'm doing okay. Kinda. Wait, are they going to the radio hut? <sighs> Phone's dead. They're gonna try to send out an SOS or something. We're holding down the fort. Oh, boy. Oh. Somebody gonna say what was that? Is that the direction? Uh, going? I don't want to. I don't want to make noise. I don't want to make any noise. I don't want to speak up. I thought you said Dylan and Ryan already left. Right, stay here. Yeah, see the, Yeah. Uh, um. We'll be fine. Just be careful. I'm gonna say, don't go. It's dangerous. We don't know what's out there. Yeah, we should all stick together. It could be dangerous. Stick together. Yeah, that's why I'm going to check it out. No, that's why we don't go check it out. <laughs> oh, no. I tried. For well, it's better than going out there without a shotgun. Yeah. For the record, I know the two of us are comfortable around firearms mm -hmm. and I know some people it's, 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 it, you know, who didn't grow up around them or, you know, doesn't live in the sticks in Wisconsin <laughs> are, are comfortable with them. So if we seem kind of casual about that, it's just because we have past experience. That's all. Oh, something's going to come through that window. Uh, there's an old pump shotgun. It's as reliable as they come, ladies and gentlemen, when it comes to firearms, <laughs> revolvers, and pump shotguns. <laughs> Actually, probably a double barrel break yeah. open. It's a yeah. little bit more reliable, but pump is pretty. Uh, Remington 870. You can leave her in the mud for a few decades, pull her out, spray some oil on it, and you're good to go. Ooh. I see that. The Red Dead Redemption in me is like, I searched the <laughs> chimney. chimney. That's what I was <laughs> thinking, too. Look for cash <laughs> in the chimney. Look in the chimney. 
<laughs> we're doing Red Dead Redemption 2 right now, mm-hmm. folks. So if you're uh, catching this and haven't seen the other ones, uh, we're progressing in that as well. As, uh, as uh, I think in a year from now, we'll look back on some of these games with uh, with enjoyment, but also kind of be able to have a laugh at, oh, oh, this dude's... Now, he doesn't seem like he's the enemy, though. No, he's, he? he's taking out the monsters, I think. Yeah, this guy doesn't it's, seem like, like a bad guy. Country boy John Cena. But she doesn't know that. Oh, oh. shoot, I missed it. I missed the... Yeah. I missed it. I didn't think there was going to... Oh, okay. Oh, fuck. Ugh. Oh, shit, I missed that. I wasn't ready. Oh, God, I should have been ready for it. God damn it. Hey, so this may not be, like, the best time per se, but, like... What? Yeah, so, like, I was just, you know, thinking about, like, the start of summer and when we first met and started camp and, well, like, now that summer's over and, you know, is that... Like the last time we're gonna see each other, you know. Oh, I'm sorry, Nick. What? What are you saying? <laughs> Pouring my heart out here. Ah, that's what it just came up with. <laughs> uh, insecure. That's your call. Don't uh, let me influence you. I want him to. I want him to be. Let her know that he's pouring his heart out. Hey, I'm kind of pouring my heart out here. Nick, I'm I'm sorry. Can we talk about this later? I'm, I'm oh. really freaked out. It's well, not a good time. It's a fair point. That's fair. Uh, bitter or intrigued? Uh, it's got to be intrigued, right? She yeah. is hard to read. You know what? She's yeah. very, very yeah. hard to read. You're hard to read. <laughs> Wait, what? You're not even listening, are you? No, no, I'm. I'm well, yeah. I think I was that boring. Oh. Uh. Gosh. You're hurt. I just want to make sure we're safe. Okay. okay. We're good. We're fine. It didn't give me an option to be like, I get it. Yeah. I had to pick between two whatever. You made yeah. Abby feel. There, Caitlin. We have died. We have died. It's okay. I got this. Oh, is this where he's going to attack uh, Hillbilly John Cena? Okay. Oh, my God. What happened? Jesus, where's the gun? We gotta get out. No, we have to hide. Get out or hide. That's gonna be your choices. Uh, he can't run. He can't run. Quick. I can't believe I missed that. I did so good with the QTEs last playthrough. Ooh, Old breath. Ooh, that was close. controller they vibrate aggressively <laughs> i like that though i know you can turn it off but well i was just thinking because if he's oh there, god he just heard us yeah girly. Oh. oh here it comes oh you're mine She's looks like mine. that <laughs> Uh, whoa, look how strong he is all of a sudden. Oh no. Oh no. This isn't good. I was say, he just took down like a 300 pound guy. Uh, now he's going to feed on him or something. Oh. He knows that he's turning already. Yeah, he knows there's something about him. The way he looked at his hand there, Nick knows something's up. No, like the other guy know that Nick's turning. Yeah. Like there you go. Radio? I thought it was just for your morning announcements. Oh, yeah, yeah. It used to be more of a actual radio station, actually. Um, uh, it, you know, I mean, it, it is still technically, but nobody brings their radio to camp anymore. Yeah. It's weird, actually, that there used to be kids with their radio and their portable CD. <laughs> Portable CD yeah, players. players. Anti-skip. Space boost. Everything we need is on the phone, but Mr. Hackett takes it on the first day of camp so that we're not distracted by technology. Um, technology giveth and it taketh. Mm-hmm. So is is that something like that you want to go into? Boy. Camp yeah. radio? 
No, you like, really uh, have a dark hair. Or music or something. Oh, um, yeah, I mean, I like you just follow music, him. But yep, I was just I think I want to major in um, look around. quantum physics. See, it's weird. In this game, Wait, I like it inverted. It's Whereas once, in Red Dead, I don't. Uh, once you get used to it one way or another, it's hard. Science guy. Oh, yeah. I mean, you know, not, not here. Um. Which is interesting because for me, for shooting games, I have to have it inverted. But for sometimes with just look around, I am comfortable with it not inverted for look around. Yeah. But for aiming and shooting i have to have it i have to have it yeah. inverted let us know in the comments are you uh do you prefer it inverted or just you know normal Make sure nothing chasing me down that trail now i'm curious what would have happened if i if i got that first qte there I wonder if you re if you would have blown him away. I don't think I don't think she was gonna shoot. Yeah. I'm I'm sorry. I'm so completely fascinated by this. What do you mean by not here? Not here at camp. I do that at home, and then here I um. You're a wise, wise cracking smartass. <laughs> uh, that's a little harsh, but um... no. Okay, so maybe I was a little nervous when I arrived in an uncomfortable social situation and I overcompensated a little bit by making a bunch of jokes. You played into it. Yeah, I mean, people kind of enjoyed the blasé Dylan. Uh, and do, do you enjoy the blasé Dylan? <laughs> Not yet. Like, you know, whatever, man. It's pretty cool. <laughs> <laughs> Um, I like Dylan Dylan. Well, it's nice to meet you, Dylan Dylan. I'm Ryan Ryan. Well, actually, I'm let's get the fuck out of here, Ryan. Yeah, I like him. He's that makes a lot of sense. Oh, we're hearing wolves. Uh, I'm wondering if this is like their this adaptation of like werewolves because they did get some sort of humanoid feature with the strength and the teeth yeah. and stuff, just not covered in hair. So it's it's kind of... Now we should explore, right? I mean, I don't think we should just beeline with, with Ryan, right? I mean, well, we are trying to get to a radio station, so my uh, my gut would say beeline to the radio because we have to try to hurry. Oh. But we still want to look for... So I thought there was stuff. Over. In most circumstances, I would say yes, absolutely explore. But right now, it's a, a time component. What is that? More of that. Uh, yeah. What in the name of oh, That's that stuff he poured on him. Is that what he poured in? Um, that's what he poured in Jacob. Maybe they place it around the camp. So that so they have it running, just in yeah. case something happens. Because remember, we found one earlier. Yeah. I wonder if that's like the antidote. Okay, so there's antidotes hidden around the camp. A, the devil. There's antidotes hidden kind of around the camp. Yeah, you see. It. Oh, the devil. Oh, card. the card. It, we That light was blowing me out a little uh, bit on that side. I didn't uh, catch it. I'm glad. Okay, so I'm glad we explored. We at least got a card out of the deal. What does that say? Room zero. Yeah, the I, those were the rooms we tried to look at. Uh, oh yeah, we. Were, oh. Uh, I wouldn't explore. I'd get to that radio <laughs> tower. What oh, was there? Lights over there. If I go back up to your right. Oh no, that's a swing. Yeah. Looked like light shooting up. Yeah. Sounds like a. Desometer from Chernobyl. Yeah, a little bit. More wolves. Oh, I'm just like, something's behind me, I know it. 
or something. Yeah, here's the radio. All good? No. Uh, give me a minute. Think in the given situation. Uh, give me a minute. All right. Huh. You're going to be walking around. Well, I'm just going to check some stuff out here. Okay, so it won't. Yeah, that's my <laughs> that's my cue to get in that radio tower. Well, we'll probably have a QT or something that'll come up. What's this here? I mean, I know it's something behind it. Ah, see, uh -huh. we're finding cards like crazy now. The hermit card. Here we have the hermit. With the hermit comes isolation, loneliness, but reflection too. Perhaps given some thought, the hermit who gives chase can guide you to safety. But that all depends on your actions, so not the his. the hermit, the kind of, the guy with the overalls. Yeah, maybe. This is the devil card we got. The devil without restriction like a shadow runs torn from one's corporeal form. Pay close attention and act before the demons unleashed. Each of us have one, even those who are pure of heart and say their prayers by Nick. night. Mm -hmm. Nick is uh, going to act on Nick before it's unleashed. Is that telling us that we're going to have some sort of decisions to make on uh, Nick a little yeah, that's later? That's what I'm thinking. Oh no. Oh no. Huh. Boy, now I'm a little. Yeah, you gotta kinda. Yeah. My way back here. That was, that was a little bit of a tricky camera angle there. Well, okay, I guess we're ready to do this. All good? Just finding some creepy tarot cards out in the woods. Don't mind me. Oh, the hermit. That kind of. Uh... You know what? They keep oh, going to the moon. Full moon dump, werewolf. Yeah. It is a werewolf, isn't it? That's what it's supposed to okay, represent. When I was a camper here, it was barely working. It hadn't been used for years, and it took me a really long time, actually, to get this place cleaned up and looking the way it is. So, I'm sorry if it's not up to your standards. Oh, look at that chainsaw back there. But I've been putting in a lot of TLC. Okay. okay? okay. It all makes Let sense now. Setup. Don't go out at night. The werewolf, the full yeah. moon, the howling. It's a hairless werewolf. Anything over here biting. we can use? Yep. They're werewolves. The power tools? No. Strap a chainsaw um, to your arm. That's Mr. H wanted more storage, so it's kind of how he lets me keep the station going. <laughs> gotcha. I mean, come on. So uh, how far does it go? Oh, um, well, it was designed just to broadcast to the PAs around camp for announcements and to, you know, portable radios and whatever. So I think the range is about a mile. <laughs> oh, no. Uh, don't think it'll help. Well, I mean, that's not going to help us being dismissive. So we yeah, got to get this I thing going anyway. How do you even know all this stuff? Uh, I just kind of picked it up. Hmm. The tech technical stuff has always been a little uh hard for me to get a handle on oh, i know the feeling right well if you like i could show you the <laughs> like a class yeah it's easy like climbing sign me up teach anyways this thing's gonna need a bit of a power up um but that's where this comes in that's my it's supposed to be a signal booster. It's kind of janky looking, but it's worth giving a shot. So we can actually talk to people with this thing? Yeah, well, it's not a two-way radio. So, um, you know, we can talk, uh, but then the best we can do is switch it over to the receiver and see if anyone broadcasts anything back, which is unlikely, but... Well, it, I mean, it is what it is, I guess. Better than nothing. Yeah. So, what should I say? Uh, just, like, make it sound urgent. Okay. Hello, 
uh, how's it going out there? This is, uh, uh, we need help. This is, uh, we are counselors <laughs> at Hackett's Quarry Summer Camp, and there's been a horrible accident attack, some stuff bad here. We need your help. Uh, there is a swarm of bears, and they are <laughs> everywhere, and there's these hunters, too, and they seem to be shooting at the bears, but also at us, um, which is not good, and a few of our friends are hurt, and um, we are in desperate need of help, so please, I mean, there's vicious <laughs> bears, and bears. Uh, we don't know what to do, so please uh, come help us, SOS, uh, this is uh, an emergency, S save our ship, come on down, please help us. Come on down. Yeah, I did good. Is that swarm yeah. of bears? Yeah. Herd of bears. <laughs> Guys, yeah, with I've the heard bears. Of bears. But oh my god. All right, uh, I'm, I guess I should just like switch either? this over to what's the receiver the, What's the proper term for a group map. of okay, bears? I'm gonna keep an eye out while you do all this techie all stuff. All right. So if this is okay, Ryan, yeah, sure. that's you, and you're gonna have to search around and check out that chainsaw. Oh boy. What's he seeing? Oh, there it is. Get away from the window. Definitely full moon Second. werewolf stuff. Wait, did he did he say lodge? I don't know. Hold on. <gasps> oh, we're picking up on them. We're picking up on the hunter's radio. Oh, no. That's totally us. I'm concerned. Holy shit, they're talking about you know us. I'm, here, I'm playing your guy here. No, they made the switch. <laughs> <laughs> <Right>. <laughs> on the Let's fucking get... radio. Fuck. I don't think those guys are bad. I don't think so. I think they here. know about the werewolf. Can't stay here. <laughs> Come on, let's, grab some let's, kit. Let's, let's stay calm, okay? Um, let's let's go find Caitlin and everybody. Okay? And the chainsaw. Grab the chainsaw, chainsaw. or something, okay. a hammer, anything. Why didn't you tell me there was something out here? You did see it. Uh, apologetic. Uh, I'm not gonna sit tell him to fuck off. I, I, I wasn't sure, man. Fuck, what the fuck was that? I have no idea. Don't. Chainsaw. Chainsaw. Well, Chainsaw. And you got a shoddy, I mean. Oh, I think it's coming through the window. Get your QTEs ready. Get the gun out, uh, yo! Okay, now I'm ready for these. Sit in bear? I don't think bears can jump like that. Okay. Is this you or him? This is all him. Okay. RT to fire. Where is it? I'm not going to shoot just randomly through the roof. No, or in noises. I'm not going to shoot through the roof, no. What was that? What is that? Waste around shooting through the roof? Yeah, no way. Makes sense. Uh-uh. Fuck. What? Caitlin, Abby, and Nick, they're coming up the path. Oh, shit. They're coming toward us. We, we, we got to warn them. Um, What about the PA? Up top? Yeah, okay. Yeah, yeah, we can um, tell them to hide or something. No. Oh, shit. Oh, I should. Now I should shoot uh, so I they know. Hold the button. Uh, Caitlin, get into a building now. Do not come up here. There's an animal outside the radio hut. Get, in, get, get into the cabin now. Go. All right. So that's. This is oh, working fuck, out. Fuck, dude. <laughs> They're gone. Okay. You shoot through the roof. Then it would just give it a hole. Yeah, and you waste a round, yeah, too. Yeah, nothing. You ain't going to hit it. What now? 
Uh, just... If it bleeds, we can kill it. <laughs> gotta, <laughs> we gotta kill it. We gotta kill it. It's not a normal animal, man. It's a fair point. I don't yep. think a gun's gonna cut it. Shotguns can be pretty. Uh, a, a chainsaw would do it, though. Uh, you got a better idea? Why wouldn't it be? Um, got a better I'm, idea? I'm all ears. Shit. You got a better idea? The chainsaw! <laughs> the chainsaw! It, it won't start. Well, if it's got hearing <laughs> like a like a dog, maybe. Uh, I mean, we could we could play a really high pitched feedback loop oh. and crank it to the max. And I mean, it would hurt like hell, but. Might work. Okay, fine. Let's do it. Feedback thing. Hell yeah. <sighs> okay. Come on, Dylan. Let's do this. Um, is it back to Dylan or is it me? What? Oh, wait. It's almost... Urgent. I don't think telling him to hurry. He doesn't seem like the kind of guy that telling him to hurry hey, would help. Dylan, just take a breath. I'm sure you can figure it out. Okay. See? Right. You rush him and he would screw it up. Right. That's, that's how I am anyway. There's something missing. I do. What's missing? Oh, crap. It pulled the wire. Fix it. I'll cover you. Fix it? So, like go outside, right. fix it? No, I don't. Do it now. Go, quickly. Oh, maybe. Up top. Whoa! Oh! 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 Oh, oh. oh now he's bit. Shoot it off with the 12 oh, gauge. Oh no. Yeah, yeah, do it, do it, do it. Terrified, no way, desperate. Do okay, it. just hang do on. It. Do it. The chainsaw. No, okay, 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 just, just hang on, hang on. Oh no. Oh no. Shotgun or chainsaw. Dude, that chain. Do you think they'll start? Are you sure? Yes, fucking do it. Oh, first pull. Must be a steal. Oh, it's just like Evil Dead. Uh. Oh. oh, what the fuck? Oh. 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 Oh, just the flash. No way we just had to do that in a video game. The wire. Plug it, plug it into the thing. Oh. Oh, keep pressure on. Oh. Oh, it's spreading, he said. Well, that was the he right thing. He knew instantly that it was spreading. What do I do? What do I do? The button, the button. Oh, right. yeah, that did it. It worked. Oh, we blew the speaker. Uh, it did the trick. Uh, nice work, Dylan. <laughs> uh, bro. Uh, Bro's gonna bleed out. <laughs> oh, right. fuck my hand. Right, right. Okay. Just hold on. Why did you do that? You told me to. Oh, that was a bad idea. Oh, can't say I've ever had to cut somebody's hand off in a video game before. Uh, these folks are going to be interested. Uh, I uncertain, I don't know. I don't know. That thing's gone, but we heard those hunter guys on the radio. What? Picked up their walkie signal. They knew we were here. Fuck, you get a message out? I'm not sure anyone heard it. Great. They're not going to ask him why his hand is gone? What the hell was going on at... 
Now he sees him. Oh my god! Dylan, what happened? Oh, um... I'm okay. I, I, I mean... I'm not, um... But it's it doesn't doesn't hurt. Okay, you're in shock. Holy fucking shit. Uh... Did that thing do this? No. Well, sort of. It... Oh! Caitlin, where's your gun? I lost it. One of the friendly locals wanted to say hi. What the fuck? Did she shoot at us? Who is this now? Who's there? Solid Snake's sister? That is Laura! That was oh, Laura! Did you was catch it? her face? You saw her? I saw the eye patch. I think it's Laura! Because in the couch co-op, they would let you pick Laura, Laura but yeah. not the guy. Yeah. Not to Max, what I believe it was. Ah, oh, shit, Dylan, what is that? Look at his arm. It was almost healed, wasn't it? Who's in the pool? Did you see they did the close up on Nick's arm? It's yeah. It's regenerating. Full moon, werewolves, the locals know about it. Yep. Mr. H saying stay in at night. Now I feel bad that it take us this long to catch up on it. They kept showing Well, I think we knew it was some kind of monster, but they really didn't start dropping the werewolf hints, I don't think, until this gameplay. Yeah. You just took off his arm with a chainsaw. Oh, we got two cards this time. Two cards. You're back. Looks like that's one less vermin in the world. I think that was Laura with the eye patch. Let's take I think a look was. once more. The devil. Without restrictions, like a shadow torn from one's corporeal form. Corporeal. They cause attention and act before the demons unleashed. Each of us have one. Even those who oh. hard and say their prayers. They want us to take out Nick. <laughs> Here we have the hermit. With the hermit comes isolation, loneliness, but reflection too. Perhaps given some thought. The hermit who gives chase can guide you to safety. Yeah. But that all depends on your actions. So Not don't his. treat the hermit like the bad, like yeah, John Cena, like the bad yeah, guy. Yeah. I like how we keep referring to him. I as want to show you Cena. more. <laughs> Would that be all right? Yes. Yeah. Hell yes. See more. Two futures to see. But only one can be seen. Mm. Uh, the hermit thing Make I think we've got. Choice. Yeah. Um, the hermit we've gotten, but I would like to see more about the devil. Yeah, same. Is this what we think it is with Nick? Yep. Oh! Somebody loses their head. That looked like Abby grabbing a we gun and losing so her head. We spend so much time looking yeah. toward the future. It's easy to forget that the past holds secrets, too. We gotta take too. out Nick. Mm -hmm. Worth remembering that. So it's goodbye again. God, I'll I love the way they do I'll this. Wait yeah. for you. That was yeah, interesting. So I, because Mason quit, and I, that's my fault, because you like to look around sometimes, and I'm like, yeah, this isn't a spot. We need to look around. We gotta go in the cabin. We had two cards. Yeah. The first time we had to make a choice between two of them. All right, this is you. Yeah. Oh, back to our guy, Jacob. <laughs> running around in his drawers. Emma! Oh, she's on the zip line. Jesus Christ. She's... Fuck! Who's Whoa. this now? Oh. oh man. God, that sucks ass. Emma, is that you? Yeah, like she yeah. was just Like, like she would say that. Is 
There's always something by a tree stump, isn't there? Nope, I guess it won't let me find out. Just I can only go down that path, it looks like. Oh, man, what kind of bridge is this? Yeah, I think, uh, I think they want you to go to the bridge. I just know that they were, you know, those other cards, they had them on the... Yeah, they had them on the, the, on the timbers. Right. But I'm, no, I'm kind of limited here. This is basically... Oh, so you're all the way back over here. Yeah. Oh, oh. One in the back. You know, the more the further we get into this, the more irresponsible I feel Mr. Hackett is for not telling the kids like, hey, there's serious danger yeah. out tonight. This is there just we go. stay inside, you'll be fine. You just stay in we'll fall off this. Well, there's foreshadowing. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Like, hey kids, stay inside tonight. Like, okay, is it just like the the camp guy telling them to stay inside or like, hey, kids, stay inside tonight. There's a lot for you to understand, but mm -hmm. uh, there's werewolves that come out yeah. during a full moon. and you'll Well, and if he was that worried, he had a vehicle that he could have. Didn't you leave in a vehicle? Yeah. Yeah. So he could have gotten all like, look, you can clown car the hell out of anything and make people fit in a car. Yeah. I mean, generally with a back seat, with any back seat, you can fit six people if you need to. Yeah. You could probably fit eight in a lot of back seats. I mean, you go three wide, and then if you need to fit six people on the back, you can go three wide and three on laps. And in a lot of circumstances, if people aren't that big, you could probably go four wide and four on laps. Yeah. Is it going to be way too much for the car? Of course. And you could probably do two in a, in a front passenger seat as well. Mm -hmm. So you realistically... If it was that big of a deal, he could have... In a medium-sized car, you could probably pack... I would say, with the driver included, you could probably uh, pack another eight to ten people in there. And we didn't even talk about well, trucks. that boat, Jill. Fucking hell. Drop a comment below. What's the most people you've ever fit yeah. into an automobile? Just a regular, I'm not talking an SUV, a regular front back seat automobile. Camera. Camera. What? Is it digital? Yeah, it looks like it is. Maybe we can see what's on it. Turn it on and look at the pictures. <gasps> oh boy. I wonder if it's the memory card from the the hikers that went missing yeah. that we saw in the newspaper. Maybe there's something on here. Does his underwear have pockets? pockets. <laughs> he just put it in the waistband. You know, those are falling out. Okay. This thing feels like it's a big circle. Yeah. Another clue. What am I? I don't get what I'm looking at with this board. Looks like a footprint, maybe. Yeah, it's a boot print. Oh, okay. Again, sometimes, folks, apologies. Um, you know, we do have lights on us, so it gives a good uh, quality image. But sometimes that blows out my vision here a little bit, and it's tough to see stuff that's dark. That's open. I might be able to adjust the contrast on the TV. To... I'll put that a little. Oh, there was another one right there. Wasn't that the camera one before? Oh, was that that was, was the that camera the... one? Yeah. yeah, never mind. That's the boot print. Yeah. So where the heck I'm dude, I'm a little turned around here right now, I'll be honest. I think I go this okay, way. Okay, so there's the that's where you found the camera overlooking the lake. So I think I need to go down to that. Yeah, pier. we might have to, we might have to go back down again. Cause that I don't go this way, do I? This long walk? Uh, maybe. We're in this Is together. This where 
no, that was the overlook. Okay, yeah, this is right. Again, sorry, folks. I, If you've seen some of other playthroughs, you know my uh, sense of direction is not all it's cracked up to be. Huh. And that's the camera. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. I've had a, a few colorful moments in my, my Hogwarts Legacy gameplay going through tunnels and <laughs> caves and stuff. Yeah. Or I've gotten quite, quite turned around. But as one thing that we've uh, we've learned here is the uh, the folks who follow <laughs> the, the Harry Potter. I'll just say this: the Harry Potter community in general tends to be a little bit kinder in their delivery of constructive <laughs> criticism. Just so we'll just we'll just put it that way. We got our first uh, first few dives and continued into Red Dead. There's been some. Some colorful commentary, but we under... Oh, yeah, you can go back up by the dock oh, I was, again. I was trying to see the uh, path. Um, yeah, the objective is to find Emma, so she may have gone from the zip line back down over here. Oh boy, I don't like this angle. I don't like this angle. And. and... Oh God, Emma! <laughs> oh, Jesus Christ! Ah, oh. uh, yeah, you scared me. Oh. Oh. oh, oh, fuck my life. Okay, you scared me. Jacob. You okay? I guess you could call it that. What the fuck is going on? Well, I don't know, okay? Some, like, bear attacked Nick and Abby back there. Yeah, me too, but it definitely was not a bear. What? Who? When? Why? Sorry, I'm just... <laughs> I'm glad you're okay. Yeah, barely. I mean, the thing that attacked me at the treehouse was like... What? It was like what, Anna? Like, out of a horror movie. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Okay, um... Well, it, it was probably just like a, a bear trying to defend itself, you oh, know? don't be a dick. You, you know it wasn't a fucking bear. Well, you're Thank right. you. You're right. And now we have these fucking... The, the hunters running all over the place. So that's a fun new wrinkle. They did this to me. That's a lot of blood. Yeah, well, it's not mine. Mm, got quite the... Funky bouquet. Keeps the werewolves no, away from him, maybe. Keeps the werewolf away. Okay. Okay, we've got to get out of these woods. Yeah, no shit, Sherlock. <laughs> Easy, pal. You know, Jacob, you don't have to be a dick about literally everything. Well, I'm trying to keep myself alive. Hey, I'm trying to keep us alive. I've been doing pretty good by myself. What? <laughs> it goes aggressive. Huh? I don't need you to rescue me. Oh. I'm not going to yeah. suddenly fall in love with you just because you're my knight in shining armor. You know? Hey, you I should learn be that, Jacob. If you set this all up. Oh my god, what? Oh boy, here they are. And we don't have any weaponry. <laughs> oh boy, here you go. Get ready, my guy. Yeah. That's it. Buttons or sticks? Buttons or sticks? Oh boy. Oh, oh now they get a thing. good look at it. Now they know. Right button. Sorry. Ah, sorry. Sorry. Uh, hiding's been working for us, and I don't want to get too far away from Emma, so I'm going to hide. <laughs> Hiding does seem to be a big part in this game. Uh, it's right up on you. Maybe it can't smell him because he's masked with that stinky stuff. Maybe. Oh, 
Hold it. Hold it. Oh, no. It's not safe. I, I was holding. I never let go. What the hell? It thinks it's one of them. Yeah. The blood. Yep. They have blood from another one that they poured on him. Yep. Come on, put it together. Put the blood smell together. The fuck? Is she going by Emma? A pig head. I wonder if that's out there for it to feed on. Maybe. Or it's a trap. Oh, there's another, bear traps another, all over. Yeah. Oh, I was just oh. going to say, don't step. Oh, God. It wouldn't be an 80s horror movie if there wasn't a bear trap, yeah. would it? You got to pry it open. You can't just yank it out. Oh, fuck. Oh, shit. He can't get it open. Look, you could. Oh. Oh. That's our guy. Yeah. Caitlin, Caitlin. this is the name. Apologies for the. <laughs> it's. That was, in... that was intense. Who is that? It's not Laura, is, she like is it? one of those hunter dudes? I don't think so. Uh, well, first we should... Well, Rational. Yeah. Should we do something? What can we do? She's dead. I mean, is she? With the body. Mm. <laughs> That's Kaylee Hackett. Mr. H's daughter? I thought she went home with her brother. Oh, Haley. Yeah. I yeah, we saw too. we saw the picture. Oh, oh man, poor Kaylee. Nick. Uh oh. He's so good. Oh boy, he's gonna turn. Intervene. Intervene. Yo, right yeah. there, Maybe dial it back a bit, huh? Fuck off, Caitlin. Look at his eyes. Whoa. Nick, what do you taste you? Hey, oh, Jesus. Ugh. Come here. Ugh, Nick, Throw him in the, the pool. Ugh, get off. Ugh, yeah, uh, out, that's Nick, it. Get off. Now he's going to come up. He's going to come out. It's be like Wolverine coming out of the tank. Rah! <laughs> what is the water burning him? I don't know. Well, can you get werewolves wet? I don't know about that one. Dude, they did in Van Helsing. It was fine. Help me. You come. Well, your call. I know what I would do. Uh. Hey, I'm comforting hey, Abby. It's okay. I'm okay. I got you. I got you. He's turning. Yeah. What did I do? Nothing blame yourself for I I don't know he's so cold okay let's get him in the pool house Drum it's like off. uh our boy wait a minute no <laughs> if we learn anything from Twilight the werewolves are warm the vampires are cold remember our scene when our dude had to cuddle up in the tent the most awkward mo moment in cinematic history <laughs> just try to rest God, that was the greatest when Jacob had to snuggle <laughs> with Bella in front of Edward in the tent, just spooning all night long. <laughs> that was the best. Oh, quit moving so much. God, I love Twilight. <laughs> it's pretty clean from what I could tell. I mean, it's not bleeding, but you can oh, see, see a doctor. I think if we use the shoddy, it'd be a lot worse. It's, it's pretty clean. But with a chainsaw. Well, I've got left in the with a chainsaw. Oh, fun. Better than a shot. Better hope uh, we find you some real help before they wear off. Oh, yeah. 
We need to be keeping a record of everything that happens. For the police. Yeah. Dead girl in the pool it needs some explaining. Because him, it looked like it already was going up his arm, didn't it? That's what I thought, too. Whatever we can. I've got a funny feeling the cops are not going to want to believe any of this crazy shit unless we've got some hard proof. The cameras. Um, camera. If you've got your phone and you see something, take a photo or a video or whatever. Yeah. The trail no cam, when he got bit, it looked like okay, they showed there, it spreading up his arm. Look, yeah. The fact that he's not bleeding. Find anything to help make Nick more comfortable. The fact that he's not bleeding and he says it doesn't hurt. Yeah. You know, that we saw the infection going up his arm. Yeah. All right, you got to... Oh, what was that on the ground? Oh. That better? Oh, Thanks. he is looking rough. Hey. Now, in their defense, they have no idea he's he, turning into a werewolf. Right. Maybe there's uh, some silver around here somewhere I can find. You mean like a silver what, it, bullet? What is, dude? I can't even see what these walls are. What is that? Is that a? It's a brick wall. There's another room there. Yeah. The moonlight coming through is just wow. I wonder if I turn the contrast on the TV. Yeah. Oh. Whoop. Look at you! Found another tarot card. I'm hit. There we go. The moon. The moon, how poignant. Tonight of all nights to harness your fear and anxiety and turn them into intuition. If you can do this and plan ahead, your cunning might okay. just save your life. So we have to plan ahead with Nick. What do we what do we need to do here? Well, it's not giving us much for options. We gotta I, I think we have to separate the group from Nick. Is what I think, and get them to realize that he is not doing well and won't be doing well. Oh, there's something. Yeah. Oh, kids drawing. This place was so different, like 12 hours. Among the miscellaneous miscellany of the forgotten belongings was a scribbling of a drawing in the woman in the woods. The ghost stories appear to really have left a mark. Yes, they did. Where's the ghost? was different 12 hours ago. Oh, what's that over? I think because I was standing by the uh, okay. locker. Yeah, it's definitely dark, but look, they, they intend it to be dark. So we have the brightness up all the way on the screen. And the only thing I can think between delineating is... I wonder where uh, Caleb is. In piece of camp history, a younger Ryan enjoying his time at the camp with Chris Hackett's kids, Caleb and Kaylee. Yeah, Ryan's been coming there for a minute. Uh huh. Yo, something is not right with that boy. Dude is real sick. Did you see how he freaked out in the water? Yeah, he was like, uh, he was like a fish out of water. Right? Uh, sure. You know, something was weird when I tried to clean his wounds, too, at the lodge. What do you mean? Well, all of his clothes were bloody, but I couldn't find where he was bit, or scratched, or whatever. He just kept moving around, like he didn't want me to see how badly he was hurt. Huh. He's healing. Rabies? There's not frothing in the mouth. <sighs> I think Abby would beg to differ. Point. Yeah, isn't aquaphobia a symptom of rabies? Hydrophobia. Hydrophobia, yeah. Ah. <laughs> it was more about a fear of drinking, not just getting wet. This was like like my cat in the bathtub. <laughs> yeah. Oh boy. Oh, get away, Abby. This is where it goes down. Abby. This is where it's gonna happen. She's gonna lose her head. You gotta save her. Of course. You gotta save her, my guy. Like me, I love you. Uh, uh, yeah, I'm gonna try to calm him down. Nick, please just tell me. 
I've really enjoyed spending time with you this summer. That's why you shoot your shot early, kids, because you never know when the, the moment will what? pass you by. Hang on, hang on. Such a cop out answer. <sighs> Abby? Uh, what? I've got something to ask you. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. Uh, yeah. Okay. Why didn't you like me, Abby? I thought it's obvious she did. I do like you. I kissed you on the log. Nick, I do like you. No, you don't. You don't like me at all, do you? What do you mean? Tell me the truth. I am telling you the truth. God, I shouldn't have had a pick up. Oh, Jesus. What? You're really very smart, aren't you? Poor stupid Abby. Stop. Whoa. Easy pickings. Oh, right off the bone. This isn't you. This this Here. isn't you. I oh! Whoa! Oh! oh Abby. Uh, Abby, everything okay? We got to shoot this guy. We got to pop Nick. We got to pop Nick. We got to oh. take him out. Look at his eyes. Pop him. Pop him. You got to. RT, fire. Shoot, shoot. Oh. But it's not going to. I don't think it's going to take care of him. You got him in the shoulder. I don't know if you could have gotten him in the heart or. See, now he's turning. Yeah. This is this is what we saw in the card. Oh. Okay, he oh, ran he out. Jumped Dude, out the we window. Saved her. We saved her. <sighs> now we all saw what happened. See, I was worried. I'm like, oh, what if I blast them and it goes bad? No, I, think I was this, really the, we because we saw the death because card. We saw the death. We played to the. They kept getting. Yeah, we, we, we had to act early as well. Uh, we're not. We're not going <laughs> to pretend like we're experts no. over here. They they didn't exactly <laughs> make it subtle, but at the same time, this is me. Okay, <laughs> <laughs> it's like an ongoing joke. <laughs> it's warm, but it's not. There was a point the last time we played. <laughs> Where it was physically like sweaty, the <laughs> hand over the controller. It's like 130 degrees and sweaty, but it is, yeah. it is toasty. Oh. Okay. So, if I were a counselor at an off-season camp, partying around a bonfire, and it started to rain, and there were monsters. I would go to the lodge. You know, I think if we wouldn't have seen the death card, I think a lot of people wouldn't have popped him. You know, they would have let it play yeah, out. And that's where he would have ripped her head off, I think. Yeah, so those tarot cards are making a big difference mm -hmm. in the way the story plays Anyone out. Finding the... Firecrackers. That could be helpful. Yeah. Yeah, so definitely, yeah, let's go check the tent. There was another tent, I thought, too. Yeah, right there. So let you go in there. Check it out. Yeah, it won't let me go in there. Oh, there's something. There we go. Uh, I got to, you know what, I'll deal with it. If it was shooting, I would have oh. to adjust the inversion, but this isn't like quick Learning action. Stories again. I had no idea kids were getting freaked out about this stuff. We officially suck as counselors. Yeah, I think ghost stories at camp are part of camp, but at the same time, mm. well, this isn't me. 
kid's letter to home. Well, we just viewed it. Yeah. Oh, you know what? Let's but take a look say, at what it yeah, says. Yeah, it'll say what they actually wrote. Oh, it, uh, it went away already. Well, let's take a Clues. look at it. Top there. Um, evidence. Devile. Oh, it's a clue, not uh, evidence. Okay. Yeah. Camp song recording. Counselor's ledger. Kids letter home. That's the one. Okay. The camper that wrote this must have had a change of heart and decided not to send this letter home. Ghost stories are only stories after Camp all. is so fun. Mr. Hackett is teaching us so much about nature and being safe in the woods. My friend Josh said he saw a ghost. I think he is lying just to scare me, but I drew a picture of her anyway. Oh, that was the one we saw in the locker. She looks quite angry, but I think sometimes when people are angry, they just sad instead. We're going sailing on the lake tomorrow. I can't wait. Love from Rowan. Okay. Okay, maybe I gotta go the other way. I think this is my. Yeah. But you never know where they might have something hidden. What was that? Something over there? No, nope, just a reflection. Mm. Yes, there's. It seems like there's grass that almost lights up sometimes when you're out in the woods. Okay, so I gotta make my way back to the lodge, apparently. Which I believe was over to the right, but you definitely want to check stuff out. Which way is the uh, lodge? I, if you go back, it's like straight past the fire, I believe. Uh, I just see cliffs here and stuff. See? Hmm. I think we have to go the other way. Maybe, maybe uh, past the tents that way, maybe? Whoa, what was that when you shined it on the ground over there? Maybe that's just the... Oh, yeah, it was the your cell light hitting stuff. So where is the path back to the lodge? Oh, is that the letter that I yep. already found? Yep, yep, that's the letter. It's not in between... This is interesting. And again, our uh, the dart. Oh, it's back that way, I think. But there was. Can you wall. climb up over that wall? Yeah. See, that's the problem. Is this what I ran into? Or those are steps. Oh my God! It's a wall. <laughs> I thought it was a wall. So did I. Holy shit! But again, the it, it's in our defense, folks. It is very dark. Oh no! <laughs> shit! There's probably. You know what makes fun for the people at home just yelling at the screen? It's those stairs! That's not a wall. Just take a look around. Yeah, I would definitely say anytime you... Because it's going to... Like, I don't think I, this... I, guys, I can't. I, I don't think in this that the monsters are necessarily always chasing you. I think it's when you get to a point they start it. So, so I think until you get to that just point, so you're Quinn free knows, to I just explore. inverted the camera. I can't. I can't operate with the camera inverted. I can't do it. I know I was saying before I could, but I just can't get used to. <laughs> I can't get used to the uh, the inversion. I forget where I was. Your path was back that way, but a little bit of exploring never hurt anybody. Because yeah. like I said, I don't think that, like if you take too long looking around here, I don't think the werewolf or whatever is going to come get you. You'll have to get to a certain point and then it'll be prompted. So I think you're pretty free to explore. And again, if I'm wrong, let me know, folks. I just got turned around even just having to adjust my camera. I just can't break that habit, guys, of uh, of the inversion. I can't. 
Man, it is. Is that a trail over there? Yeah. Or is that where we came from? That's the yeah. That's where you came from. So now, okay. as long as you go straight back that way, you'll be headed in the right way. But it is getting foggy, like yeah, Silent Hill foggy. foggy here. So I'm gonna try to just walk here. Okay, yeah. this is keep much your better. keep your camera light down. There we go. And then you're there's oh, something. there's something there. We must have done this. Oh, washed out the road. <sighs> Okay, this looks like somewhat of a trail, huh? Okay, that's back that way. Mm -hmm. It's interesting the way the camera is turning too. Yeah. Well, you can, you can change that too. Does L one or R one switch anything in this with the camera angle? I don't know mm -hmm. if we've. Uh, Nope. No, I think you can, you can spin yeah, you and adjust spin a little bit, but you're it's limited. That cell phone battery. Oh, is that something up there? There we go. Now it feels like I'm on the right path. Yeah. See, like you could have explored that whole time, and you wouldn't have had the monster come until you got here. Yeah, I just, um, and it's funny, so I haven't, before we started the gaming channel in December, I hadn't played Call of Duty, and I, look, I know I, people are probably like, oh, we're tired of playing Call <laughs> of Duty. Tired of hearing about Call of Duty, we know. <laughs> but it's, no, but, uh, you know, we have different people watching different yep. games, so yep. it's like, I played that for so long that my muscle memory with the cameras, I can't break myself out of inverted. The first time I was flying... The broomstick in Hogwarts. <laughs> I do. I was. I'm like. I'm gonna try it. I'm gonna try it, and I couldn't do it. So finally, after about 15 minutes of just like almost oh. dropping, oh, it's mushrooms or something. And uh, and prior to the gaming channel, I hadn't picked up a controller in probably 25 years. So yeah. this is real which fresh for me. And which creates an interesting it. dynamic for us because I think a lot of people when they when they see oh there we go. Rope. Oh, what is that? Oh, is that the one that he was? He got caught in? Are we all the way back to that part? Yeah, I think so. Yeah, it just lets me look at it. And yeah. I... Um, but so what I was saying is that it, it creates an interesting dynamic for our gaming channel because. Um, I think a lot of people who have established YouTube gaming channels are people who are really experienced at it. Yeah. And so when they have people coming and, and watching, there's a certain expectation as far as skill and experience with games in general. Um, whereas with us, if you are new to this gaming channel, we have had a pretty fair amount of success with our reaction channel. Am I going back the way I came from? No. Uh, we've had a pretty fair amount of success with our reaction channel. Uh, if you haven't checked that out yet, we're you know a little over two hundred and sixty thousand subscribers, and you know we wanted to kind of expand on our YouTube presence and take on a new project. And you know we put out a poll on Patreon for the YouTube members, and everybody had said, um, "Do a gaming channel, do a gaming channel." And so <laughs> not sure if they were aware of our skill level. Yeah, and so we decided, so you know what, we'll we'll do a gaming channel. Um, but as those of you who have. Um, seen so far what we did which is detroit become human and we're starting our our second run through there our good guy non-aggressive run through if you haven't uh if you haven't seen our run through of detroit become human and you're a fan of that sort of thing from what we were told <laughs> we delivered an ending that nobody had ever seen before yeah, a lot of unique stuff in our first time around good uh good bad or otherwise i think bad is probably the the best. Uh, I prefer unique. unique. I wouldn't say bad. It's, it's unique. unique ending. Not a lot of people yeah. hate it. For if I got to give a little bit of a spoiler. Um. But in any regard. Yeah, I mean, for me, the whole oh, arcade go. has been just a learning experience yeah, for everything and getting the hang of. What is this here? Oh, you're all. The Did way I back just here. take a? 
Holy shit, I just took a giant lap. Part of me wants to be frustrated, but part of me is like, this is exactly what what happened. And, uh, okay, it won't let me walk this way any further. I can't believe I just took a giant lap. You can't keep going that way? It just stop you? Which way did I go? Just go straight this way now. Yeah. I thought that's where I came from. Maybe go to the right this time? Trying to stay as far right as I can because mm -hmm. I feel like I... Oh, here's the lodge. Okay, there we go. There we go. Boy, I... <laughs> It's dark here. Yeah, you I really got you really got to aim yourself. I think they're doing that intentionally so that you have to keep your cell phone camera low to see where your character's walking and not up searching for things. Oh boy, and I know the the lodge is right over there. It is getting real. Yeah, you got to aim your camera lower, I think, to see the path. All right, let's. Yeah, see. Is that it? Yeah, that's the path, and I think if you head back up. It is. Are you able to, to move the camera so that it's not aiming at the back of your head necessarily? See, it can kind of level things yes, out, or no? It doesn't. With the, uh, the joystick doesn't do it? See, there's the there's the lodge right there. I see it, and I'm just trying to find the path to said lodge. And down over here. There's nothing. I just think I need to keep... Okay, that gives me... All right, there we go. So if I hit R... I just did R... The R3 button, and it gave me a different point of view. Okay. Interesting. Okay, well, learning all the time. Didn't I just walk right by the lodge? No, I don't think you're there. Am I walking fucking backwards again? Bro, I'm going to lose my shit here in about two seconds. Where is the lodge? You were, I think you were headed on the right path. Not this way, but up that way. All right, folks. Again... Okay. Yep. Yeah. Oh, fuck. Uh, ha, I thought you were going over in your chair. You can't do that. You might have to do a QTE right away. <laughs> Take that. For me. Make the save. Dude. <laughs> okay, so that's where the monster came from. So you want to go towards us. Nope, that's the wrong way. Spin around and go. No, go I back. have to. I think I go have to. that way. That's where you have to go. Because you turned around to see the monster that was behind you. Yeah, but I think I have to keep going in the same direction. Yeah, yeah, you got to keep going this way. Don't go towards the monster. I'm saying going but away from it. Did I turn around in... I don't think I physically turned the person around. You did. You Yeah, you turned him around with the, the camera and, and looked around. Oh, see, I thought that it just gave me a different camera angle when I got to that point in the game. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. So now you're in like a bit of a cavern almost with walls on each side of you. Here I am telling you which way to go and I openly admitted to having a poor sense of direction. Oh, we'll see how this plays out for us. This does feel new though. Although I don't feel like we should have been walking for this long. Uh, I think your sense of direction just got me turned around, dude. 
because I think when I was walking, it went into a cinematic mode to show the monster running by. And then when it gave me the controller back, I had to keep going in the same direction. You know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. yeah, and you, you did. No. I turned around. <laughs> we did not. I turned around. I knew I did. Okay. Might have to uh, fast forward that bit, maybe. Yeah, we'll get there. It was about... Yeah, so the camera... So it gave me a QTE, or it gave me a... A jump scare, basically. It gave me the jump scare and flipped the camera, and then when I got back, it turned around to look, but like uh, I needed to keep going in the same direction. You see what I'm saying? Yeah. So the guy who openly admits... The openly the admits to having now, that, that being said... Uh, that being said, I think given the difficulty of, again, I folks, I don't want to make excuses, but the, the game is pretty hard for us to see, and they had a... A lot right. of fog going on and uh, easy to get spun around. I'm wondering if um, if we up, uh, adjust the contrast on the TV, if that will help. So we have studio lighting in here, of course. Um, so you can see our beautiful yeah, faces. Our, our left and our right here. Um, but the one thing about studio lighting is it's not directly shining on the TV. But the other thing I want to also recognize is that we're well aware that there's other. Yeah, see, there's the lodge. I'm well aware that there's other people playing games out here who, you know, will take this path. Mm -hmm. um, that playing games that successfully do this, but we'll get there again. Uh, yeah, there we go. Is that a car? Is that a log? Oh, it's rocks. It's another rocks. path. Uh, I don't think I want to take the other path. Huh? Heard. Well, if you're if you're confident with where you are, there might be some clues to find or something. I am maybe. not confident where I am right. at all. Because I thought the lodge should be up here to my right, should it not? Um, I think a little bit more right forward. Right there, I can see there. it. The path, I think, goes around. Where is... Oh, maybe you do need to go that way. Is it letting you go forward? Yeah. Okay, you it are. Is. I'm on the right path. Yep. Now. There's the lunch. <laughs> Bob. No. Don't you. He cuts you and you know who I They capture one? Oh, yep. they did. Oh, she Bob. needs to realize. Oh, they We've want to get the blood. Before, Let's do it fast. That's it. Yeah. But that's not our vision watching them. That's somebody else, see? Yeah, they're yeah. hiding. <laughs> No, I don't no. want to. I don't want to. Yeah, because that thing will chase you. The other one that's out there. I don't want to run. I don't want to run here. Nope. Let those guys deal with it. Now remember, they're they're the hermits. We kept getting God the hermit damn card it. as friends. God damn these fucking kids! Oh, is that is that Sorry. Nick? What? Oh, was that Nick? I think it was. Nick, hey, stop! Stop squabbling. Give me the truth. Is she bit, Pop? I'm not supposed to know. I don't know. Let me look at her. Nah. Get the fuck away from me! Oh! Oh! What is she doing? Firecracker. Oh, she's toast. I'm trying to save her, I think. Oh, they totally are, yeah, but I think we might have Caitlin! set her up. Ryan! Shut the door. Abby! Just leaves the door open. It doesn't feel safe. Oh, certainly not with the door open. Oh, my God. Fireplace. Door open. I didn't want to run right there because I was in the vision of the other monster. Right, and monster. if you would have ran, it would have just gone after Abby? you. And who knows if... And we've gotten the other tarot cards saying that these guys are not... They're the hermits, but they're not bad. Yeah, they might show oh. us the way. Although I just threw a firecracker Ryan? in the one guy's face. Trying to keep everyone alive here as we can, <laughs> folks. Oh, 
you know, the thing too is this whole the van's thing. not actually broken down. He just pulled the part. Yeah. But then he lost it in the river, didn't he? In the lake? I don't know. All, All right. I know is this whole thing, everything happening here is because one horny young man wanted to have an extra night with a girl who wasn't that even into him. Yep. Even that into him. There's your full moon. Yep. There's the pool. Oh. Ugh. Ryan, uh, this is me. Yep. I killed him. He ripped his own I mean, skin off. Dead people don't usually jump out of windows and run into the forest. He did what you had to do. Yep. Abby, he was going to hurt you. You were defending yourself. I, I don't... I don't know that for sure. Uh, we do. I we do. do. He okay. does. No. It was you or him. And, well, that definitely wasn't him. Its Man, skin so came off. Fucked. Hey! Oh, shit. Where the fuck is Chris Hackett? Suspicious. That's... That's our girl, Laura, I think. Who's there? I need your help. Please. Who are you? My name is Laura Kearney. So? I knew it. Don't let me in. It's not safe out here. Uh, yeah, there's a crazy woman with a gun killing people. I'm not killing people. Holy shit, you... Laura Kearney? You're Laura Kearney? Yes? You were supposed to be working, uh... Helping out in the nurse's office, right? Yeah. And you never showed up. You found the clues. You and the guy. What's his name? Max. Yes, Max. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, Mr. Open Hackett the door. You had changed your mind last minute. I, I think that we should. I think that we should listen to her inside. Yes. Open the door. I'm gonna open the door. Okay. I'm gonna open the door slowly. Just keep your hands up. Okay. Okay. Don't. Oh, look at oh. her face. Full on Metal Gear. Oh, man. Laura's Mason Quinn's character. <laughs> I should have picked her. <laughs> Damn it. Here we are again. Just <laughs> you, me. Me, too. Why don't we take another look at what you've found? Mm. Sounds good. Moon card. The moon. How poignant. Tonight of all nights. To harness your fear and anxiety. Turn them into intuition. If you can do this and plan ahead, your cunning might just save your life. Which we did. Now tell me, would you like to delve deeper into... One of many possible futures. I wonder if this is almost like a little spoiler where if you're playing the game on like a harder difficulty, you would just move on and not take the little hints here. Maybe. Uh, I don't know. Okay. Oh, oh so this, this is, is what, Laura. She's yeah. got her eye covered. Oh, oh. Laura stabbed the, the cop, the sheriff, and got free and locked him in the gate. See, I'm glad we talked. Yeah. Because that's not force exciting. That tells us a backstory. Yeah. Exciting. Yeah, so well, that wouldn't have helped us with the game down. at all, but it just definitely gave us one a backstory. One down, she said. How exciting. Let's see what kind of spot we're in here. Eh, maybe so, run a little, uh, little longer here for this one. Why didn't you come? Where have you been for the past two months? Kicking ass. Come. One night early. The last full that moon. That was our yep. mistake. She gonna give? Oh, I guess we're taking over for Laura here. Oh, what? Oh, whoa! Oh, damn it! I knew I should have picked Laura. <laughs> now the controller's gonna be us. <laughs> Although this is this might just be a cinematic yeah, story about what happened. Cinematic. Oh, this is so cool that they're giving us backstory. She still has her eye. That night was probably a full moon they came in. Yep. 
Sad Max. I'm gonna, I'm gonna call out. I know we've been staying uh, quiet lately, but maybe this guy needs uh, to see I'm still alive. Come here. Come on. Oh, Max got. Whoa. Are you goddamn kids. <laughs> it's always kids. Oh, this fit. Would it really be a. Now I'm getting some Texas Chainsaw Massacre vibes. The sheriff just wanted to keep the kids away from. Yep. Here it comes, questioning. What have you done to Max? Shut up. You can't just. Shut up! This is an interrogation. I ask, you answer. This is wild that we get backstory now. Name. Uh, you know what? Uh, Laura's not going to know what's going on. She's going to be Oh, angry. no, no. <laughs> Shit. <laughs> if he gives me a reason to be compliant, I will. When I say name, you give me your name. Do I make myself clear? You've got my license. Can't you read? I am an officer of the law. I need you to do as you're told. Dude, he was and trying to help. Goddamned question. Well, I think that would be her reaction, though. Oh, I'm trying to I play it realistically. Okay, now I'll be compliant. I see what you're saying. Yeah. You're going along with her character. Yeah. What do you want to know? Oh. Well. Uh, why are we going to hack his quarry last well, night? Well, you weren't ready for the Max question. Max and I are camp counselors. Oh, bullshit. Counselors aren't due until today. I told you, we drove up and got there early. We figured we'd just go to camp. Why didn't you go to the motel like I told you? Because we were, like, way closer to the camp, and we're broke. Hmm. Teenage mm -hmm. kids don't have yep. a lot of money. You can't even this. rent a hotel room until you're, like, what, 25? North Kill County, then. Intrigued. intrigued. I want to hear a story. Yeah, so I'm going to be intrigued, I think. Okay, Sheriff. Hack it. <gasps> Wait. Hack it? Like, Chris Hack it? Don't change the subject. Oh. What the see? fuck is going on here, man? Oh, you have no yeah. idea what's going on here. Not a goddamn clue. You just stepped in some grade A double prime... Go ahead and kill yourself cosmic type shit, young lady. And your only option is to buckle the fuck up and do what I say. Do you understand? Uh, uh she's not gonna uh, just I wanna hear the story. Well, I know, but he's like get to the point already. That's what I'm I know, but she's he's stop. not gonna play well if you say stop okay. fucking around. I just want to hear the story. Okay. Because <laughs> I'm, I'm like, intimidate me and tell me what the fuck is. Going That's basically on. what I wanted to say. Yeah, yeah. Is, is Max alive? No. I feel like I'm going crazy. What? Is this where she grabs the... the yeah, the I think it driver? is. I think this is... Lash out. Well, we did in the thing. Don't do it. Don't do it. Because that's what's predicting the future, remember? Yeah, that's who they showed us. Let's go. Yeah, because that's what would have happened. I would have turned around and stabbed him in the neck, and yeah. who knows? Hey. Holy shit, Max hey, is you alive. Asshole! You want to tell us what the fuck's going on? What was Max? all that I know noise then? Like. Fuck. He's keeping you alive until the full moon is done. Yeah. He got bit. Um, uh, are you that's concerned? Okay. Max! 
Are you okay? Yeah. Wait. I mean, I'm, He's healed. I'm kind mm -hmm. of all mixed up, but... He's too healed. What, did he rip More all the skin intact, off? I think. And then came back? No, I wonder if that's... Turned, Laura? See? Path updated. Yeah. Why am I naked? What? Because you ripped your clothes off. I mean, after we got attacked... I probably wanted to see if there was The bites. next thing I know, I'm waking up in a jail cell, and you're gone, and now you're back again, and, and, and I'm super naked, and there's blood and stuff everywhere. I mean, what the fuck happened? Well, we went down into a cellar. Uh, he wants. He wanted me to confess. I'm disappointed. I would hope you might know. She, yeah, she doesn't know. Yeah. So I'm gonna. Yeah. So yeah. our host was very keen on getting me to confess, but I honestly couldn't tell you what I was meant to be owning up to. Jesus. What he used to try to get you to talk: the pincher, the blade, <laughs> three-hole punch. No, it, he wasn't torturing me. Who does this guy think he is? Sheriff of North Kill, apparently. Chris North Hackett. Hill? Yeah. Max. What? Did you even look at the map? Hackett's Quarry in North Kill. That's the town. Oh. And it gets better. Please. I gotta look at his name badge and... Uh-oh. This is so much cool backstory, isn't it? Yeah. Oh, he's giving him his clothes back. See? Probably just wanted to make sure that his... Wait, can we change the future Get of the dressed. game? What's he giving you? <gasps> not going to be the guest of honor at Fashion Week, I'll tell you that much. Hey! Did I say you could talk to each other? Well, that's the thing. It's interesting because Laura ends up who she ends up as. Yeah, but I'm we... Just wonder if it I just want to see if there. we can create a different path yeah, here. I'm going to be sarcastic on this one. I wasn't aware we needed your permission. She locked me in a cell. <laughs> I know, yeah, but I'm, I'm trying to get oh. the other outcome other hang than... On here, hang on, hang on, hang on. I'm trying to get the other outcome other than her jabbing her in the neck. Right, which I think we did because that would have happened in the office when he uncuffed us. All right, right. Hands through the bars. Come on. I think he's clearly trying to help, so I'm trying to Your defuse turn. the situation here. Let's go. Well, I, anyway. I want some answers. Here. Come on. Hey. Hey. Oh, is he going to bite him? Fuck off. Come on. Move. Good boy. Just like you'd say to a dog. Hey! Stop struggling. He's literally just trying to get, keep these killed. I'll tell Max to calm, calm the down. calm down. Max, calm down. You're only waking up first. Thank you. Because remember, they showed the us the future of Nick tearing Abby's yeah, face yeah. off. And yeah. we were able to change we were able okay. to change that. Yep. Yeah. So I'm not sure if okay. she takes it easy. Think, Laura, think. There's got to be something in here you can use. Oh, maybe it's still yet to happen. Well, yeah, because she doesn't have her patch and dude's still alive. Yep. I don't think it showed her jamming something into his neck. That would probably work. Spoon. Ew. Spoon? Well, it's got a pointy end. You could make it a pointy end. Do we have the option of not stabbing him in the neck, though, and changing the outcome? Because I don't know, because she shows up to the door with the patch on. Yep. Oh, what does it say on the wall? Get While there. the town of North Kill lay there sleeping, the hag in the woods started weeping. As the bodies decay, the wolves hunt their prey, and the sheriff continues his creeping. Ooh, a scrawled limerick. Okay, so what's next to the, the can there? Sis. Loose brick. <gasps> it's a key to finding the Not a Templar's treasure. <laughs> I need some sort of lever. Like a spoon. Like a spoon.
There's your lever. <laughs> that could work. I'm thinking we do this to the sheriff regardless. Yeah, I don't know. We'll see. Because we, we changed it before. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. We changed the, the, the her vision before. Ah, yes. What is that? Oh, here boy. it comes. We're going to whack him with the brick. No, no, no. no brick whacking. He gave him his clothes back. Nobody's hurt. He took one cuff Watch off. Watch it, yeah. man. I bruise easily. Uh, Give me a break. Am I going to go Ron Weasley on this guy? Get out of here, you're toast, motherfucker. Oh, Jesus. Sure. Second you get out. What's that supposed to uh, We'll answer your questions. Wait, wait. We'll... <sighs> Answer your questions. You just can't lock us up in here with no goddamn explanation and expect us to be all butter and cupcakes, Capes. We're yes. with us here. You have nothing to bargain with. Come on. Come on. <laughs> hey, you can't just leave us in here. Hey. Come back. See, th th this is, these are typical kids in horror movies. We talk shit to the cop like it's going to get you somewhere. <laughs> Scream, come back. Oh, okay. I'll come Fuck. back. Binky bonky. Binky bonky. Well, I don't know that I'd be... Well, I want to know how... Well, I, I'm going to be... the. Uh, I guess, given the situation, I'm going to be playful. All right, yeah, there we go. How'd it go in there? You sing like a canary? Nothing to sing about. I'm sure you've got plenty to confess. <sighs> well, that may be true, but I don't think he's too interested in how I cheated off Mikey Washington in eighth grade cab. Really, though? What happened? Here we go. He, uh, he just asked a lot of questions, a lot of weirdly specific questions about us and where we were going and why and how I was feeling this morning. And I don't know. Nothing I said made him seem any less annoyed. It's because he told you to go he to the motel. You were feeling? Yeah. Because he knows well, you're he a werewolf. You? No. He didn't ask uh, us shit. Rude. You get a bed to sleep on? That's not too bad. Probably more comfortable in here than it is at Hackett's. Huh. Oh, hey, did you get a look at his name badge? You mean here it's not go. really Detective Dick Whip it? <laughs> it's Hackett. Buddy Wackett. Sheriff Hackett. You think he's related to Chris Hackett? Oh, my God. Like the Chris Hackett? Yeah. Who's the Chris Hackett? As in camp leader, Mr. Hackett of Hackett's Quarry, remember? Last night feels like a lifetime ago. The fuck does that mean, though? You know? Where we set up? Maybe it's some kind of crazy camp counselor kidnapping ring. That's... I mean, what? He's yeah. He's not acting like a kidnapper. No. And the idea, of, the idea of it being a setup is kind of ridiculous. I'll be reflective. Well, I guess Sheriff Hackett's not exactly acting like a typical kidnapper, but he's not acting like a typical cop either. It's very well, how fair. do you know how kidnappers act? That's also yeah. very fair. <laughs> See movies. I'm just trying to get us out of here, and I can't get us out of here until I have some clue of why that the fuck we're in here. Because you didn't listen and go to the know. motel. What if we can't make sense of it. Well, you have to. Sometimes things just don't make sense. 
What then? We're just stuck in a backwater jail cell for the rest of our lives? Oh, this isn't... Yeah, you're not going to be here forever. I'm going to be encouraging. This isn't forever, Max. You, you can't just hold us here forever. You didn't seem too convinced of that. You gotta stay positive. You can't think like that. Why not? Might as well just accept it, right? No, fuck that. Well, they didn't give us an option to play with Max's what character. What about the rest no. of the summer, Max? <laughs> That's because Max... I mean, I... I've been dreaming about becoming a vet since I was five years old. I'm not going to let this fleabag fuckface stop me. It's because Max doesn't make it. We're going to get out of here. He's a wolf. I'm going to study to be a vet, and you're... Gonna... Um... What? I'm gonna what? I saw the letter, Max. What are you talking about? The rejection letter for college. I found it in your bag. You were poking around in my stuff? I can't believe you didn't tell me. Just wanted to have a fun summer. Yep, that's I, where it all started. I was embarrassed. Wait, your grades were good and you wrote a great essay? Yeah, apparently not good enough. Fuck. You've been making plans, Max. What the fuck? I don't know. What do you want me to say? Oh, if they've been making plans at the same school and everything. Mm -hmm. Maybe uh, uh, not not the time to be sarcastic and yeah. break us apart. We need to be empathetic. Yeah. I'm sorry, Max. This, this really sucks. Path updated. Ooh. Wow, hey, that not changed the, worst the path. Thing that this summer. Oh, every time it gives me path updated, I'm like, oh I'm sorry. I shouldn't have kept it from you. You know you can talk to me about anything, right? Yeah. Yeah, I do. There nice. we go. Nice work, Mason Quinn. They're really baiting me with the... Uh, hey, let's just focus on getting out of here. For baiting now. me with Great. Sheriff Hackett. Yeah. We need to go over it from the beginning. Like from when we left home? Like from when we ran into the cop. So after we ran into the... Whatever we ran into? Yeah, that's when shit started getting weird. Yeah. The dude acted super weird when we said we almost hit an animal. You remember that? It was like he already knew or something. Yeah. Yeah. It was, was a really full sketchy. moon that night. Mm -hmm. What if he's not even a real cop? Well, he's got to be dirty, but... I mean, I think he's a real cop. We're in a police station. I mean, yeah, but there's like... Nobody else around. Small town sheriff's offices people. That's how they work. Yeah, that yep. is concerning. Especially the whole hack it hack it thing. Let's just go with the idea that they're both in on it. Okay. So we're supposed to meet Chris Hackett at the camp, and instead, there's nobody there, and we get attacked by. You came something. a night early. He didn't approve and it. And the cop shows up. That part's all fuzzy for me. Like I, I remember the steps and a smell like wet fur and a. A dog collar with the name Ian on it. Ian? Ian. Dog. I don't think it was a dog that attacked us. Whatever it was was big. Like, person-sized big. Yeah, it really did a number on you. Like, I'm surprised you're not more messed up. Like, like, like I vividly remember the thing's teeth ripping into you. Oh, no. Yep. What is messed up about that is... Got bit. Laura, I don't have a scratch on me. Uh what? oh Hey. Yep. Okay, so weird question. Do you remember before we got lost? You got lost? Well, yeah, but before that, I was all like, whoa, look at the moon. It's so big, so cool to see a full moon in the middle of the woods. And you were all like, yeah, no together. shit, Max, it happens once a month. Putting yeah, it together. So? Right, so, you know, full moon. Yeah. Wet dog. Wet fur. What if... Uh... Say it. Okay. No. Stop. I'm just saying, you know, maybe there's a slight chance it was a werewolf. Are you out of your... Goddamn mine? <laughs> Werewolves? Seriously? Nice. What the fuck? What? 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 What's so funny? I said literally the exact same thing. Okay. Do you, you got anything better? I mean, like, zombies? Aliens? Time hopping Draculas. Look at her face. Ooh. I wouldn't. I'm going to be yeah, calm about yeah, this situation. Right? right? 
Yeah? You want answers? I've got answers. Interrupt me again, you're on your own. Whatever. Would it really be so crazy? With all the shit that we've been seeing with Nick? With the thing on the roof? Okay, it would really start to explain a lot of stuff. Dylan, Thank you. I'm just trying to keep an open mind, okay? This is like your ghost stories. How is this so different from your ghost those, stories? Those are, those are just campfire stories. Like, there has to be a rational explanation for everything. For is there? This. Does there? Okay, you were not talking so rational when you separated my hand from the rest of my body. You told me to. And if it's bite with which you're faced, cleave limb from torso with great haste. What? You did the right thing. See? She's got a whole poem about it. <laughs> There's more to all this than you think. Ugh. Ooh. They can show us? Nope. Just let me finish, and you can decide for yourself if you believe me or not. I don't care. But I think you should hear all of it. Back to the jail cell. The next few weeks were long. The we'll figure this his out and then yeah. take yeah. showers, but aside from that, we barely saw him. All summer. Max and I, we talked. A few weeks? A lot. Wow. As much as we could about what happened that night. It was like trading conspiracy theories. We talked about the cop, the camp, the accident, the woods, the thing in the basement, what happened to Max. We just kept going over it all again and again, and nothing was making sense. Yeah, because they were there all summer, basically. Yeah. All we knew is that we needed to get out of there. I can't take this anymore. It's not that bad. Probably in the same crap at camp. No, I can't take being in here anymore. Oh, oh boy. Going stir crazy. Yeah, well, that part's pretty tough. We've got to do something. We've got to get out of here. We need a, p a plan. We keep saying that, but it's been weeks, so. Start you know, filing know down the one. end of that spoon. File it That's down really till it's sharp. That's really not very helpful, yeah. Max. You are forgetting something. What? Just the ETBT tiny detail that I may or may not be a fucking werewolf, Laura. So what? What can we do? Really? We run off into the sunset. Oh, he to wants to wait him. until the next full I moon. I turn into a nasty-ass yep. monster and kill you and eat you, and then I run off alone into the sunset with little bits of you stuck in my teeth. Okay, okay, stop. Just one problem at a time. All right, we, we don't even know if that's what's really going on, and we won't until we get the hell out of here. Okay. Well, it seems to me that we only have two real options. We can play nice and try to get this guy on our side. What, so he'll let us go? Or... We try to catch him off guard and make our escape. Plan B. Well, okay. I'm going to try to change the future, folks. So I'm going to go curious about good side. Okay, so let's say we get on his good side. What but then? Show French us and the mimosas every camp. Sunday till he sees the error of his That's ways? That's what I'm confused yeah, about Yeah, I was here. being rhetorical. The dude doesn't have a good side to get on. I mean, he don't even talk to us half the time. I don't know. I think we could crack him. Laura, I think he's just biding his time until he can figure out a way to get rid of us. Permanently. No, he's seeing if you respond at the next full moon. Yep. Uh, why don't we just stay optimistic? Yeah, stay optimistic. I think we should try. I mean, if he was going to kill us, we'd be dead by now. So what's he waiting for? Look, we just... Full moon. If this doesn't work, we try to escape. Deal? Deal. Yeah. There you go. Deal. So, all right, how are we supposed to get this guy to like us if he won't even talk to us? I don't know. I mean, he's got to have a weak spot, like something we can use. It's not like we don't have time to figure it out. Yeah. Okay. Well, they just hey, they hey. just keep us rolling. T money. <laughs> yeah, I'm call sure. You T money. I'm sure calling him T money mm -hmm. is gonna work. Why? Yeah. You can call me Officer Hackett. T money. Hmm. Hackett. 
Like as in Hackett's quarry? What's it to you? Just interested is all. Feel like we hardly know you. Well, let's keep it that way, okay? Oh, come on, Team Money, lighten up, man. No reason we can't be buds, right? Oh my god. Oh, this, this guy. I can think of seven. Seven reasons. I'm gonna be skeptical, like, really? Really? Seven? Failure to comply, trespassing, dangerous driving, <laughs> breaking and entering, resisting arrest, endangering local wildlife. And you keep calling me names. Yeah, but aside from all that... It... Okay. Look. There's no reason why we can't change things. Why does it all have to be so ugly all the time? Oh. I see what you're doing. Well, it's not gonna work. <laughs> you think we're just gonna be besties, and I'm gonna let you walk right out of here. Not gonna happen. Asshole! Max! Why won't you he just tell us? You know what's going us? on? Yeah, thank you. We know Max is a werewolf! Thank you, finally, just uh, throw it out oh, there. in a few days, right? What, what then? No, ma'am. You don't know the half of it. Oh, struck a chord with the werewolf thing. Yep. Oh, it's being all weird and I cryptic. Said, take your fucking clothes off. Fuck off. Get back. Max, what's going on? Get the fuck away from him. I was tasing him. July 23rd. It's almost the end of summer. Come here. Shut up. Shut up. <laughs> <laughs> That's what he says. Shut up. Quit squirming. Said you want to be a vet, right? Call us an internship. Let me go. You're not going to believe it until you see it for yourself. Oh, he's going to turn right Just in front of her. Fucking ask next time then, dude. Jeez. Don't get too close. That sounds like the dudes from the woods. Mm-hmm. Just wrapping things up here. Uh, if I call for help, they're going to know he's got somebody. I think he wants to keep it on the down low. Otherwise, he would have said something. I'm going to... Yeah. Down to 20. Over. What's going to happen? Plus, it shows she's cooperating with him. Well, I'll tell you. It's not going to be pretty. But don't worry. I'll be back at dawn. You're really going to leave me here? You'll be fine. Just don't get too close. Are we going to see it? <laughs> we, 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 were saw, gonna, we saw it with Nick a little we, bit. We were going to take a little break, folks, and uh, cut, cut this uh, one, but not now. That's probably why he wanted to take his clothes off so he wouldn't rip his clothes. Yeah. It's starting. Is he gonna howl? Tell me tell me what you're feeling. Let's be clinical. She wants to be a vet, right? Max, tell me exactly what you're feeling. Feel all right. I don't feel so good. Not good like how? I don't know, just bad come closer let me see your eyes i think i better stay back max i need to observe you don't get too close oh is this fucking close enough for you bitch oh <sighs> doesn't is... laura kind of look like alicia from fear the walking dead do you mm, a little bit how much fear of the walking dead do you think I actually watched? Max. <laughs> oh, here it comes. Hands are gonna grow out. Hey, what's going Fur's on? Fur's gonna come up the back. Oh, we saw this in Michael Jackson's thriller video. Get away! Oh, this is so cool. 
Because with Nick, we saw it like happen whenever, but this is full of the full moon. Yeah. Yeah, oh, there it is. Skin just pops right off. The big splat. Oh, oh that's how she got, got the eye. eye. Oh, that's how we lost the eye. Yep. How did she get off the. Away from the pipe? Did he break it? I don't know. I think he must have broke it. Oh, this is going to be the big reveal. Oh, keep the scissors. Yeah. <laughs> oh, this is intense. So much for depth perception. Yeah. Holy shit. Should we pause here? See, or, well, we might as well. I mean, if it's, yeah. it's playing. Let's see what that bastard cop's hiding. Okay, yeah, he did break the pipe when he swiped at her. That's what I thought. Oh, well, huh. let's go see what this looks like down here. <laughs> I figured if I stayed away from the thing, I'd be okay. Let's see what he looks like. Uh, d uh, easy! You want to get a look, don't you? I do want to get a look. <laughs> can I walk up? I don't think you can. No, that's all it's giving me. <laughs> <laughs> Fucking guy. Well, you'd want to see what happened, don't you? Uh, this might be a good spot to pause, though, realistically. Yeah, yeah. I think so. I'll, I'll hand it over to you to do the, do the pause. And we originally planned on stopping this probably 30 minutes ago, but the story just kept rolling. And for quality of content, we didn't just want to do a hard stop and leave the story. Although that would have been a hell of a cliffhanger to leave off on yeah, Laura showing take up. Take a look at the tarot cards we got. Yep. So we have missed quite a few of these tarot cards. Yeah. Probably half. Well, we got six out of 22, but... I don't know if they're in order, though, so... Yeah, so we still have that many yet to go. A lot. I mean, not terrible. We've gotten... <sighs> Damn it. We missed two in the beginning, and then we did pretty good and missed two more, but we got the next five. Well, I think the important... Five out of eight we got. The important thing to notice... Okay. So there's a lot of places feels like we haven't gone yet yeah. or no this is just a location of the camp well this mm -hmm. is kind of cool we really haven't checked this out too much um so it gives us laura objective evidence which we've looked at clues mm -hmm. yeah and that's yeah and path. Stuff, yeah oh let's uh a helping hand <laughs> <laughs> view your path i want to see this once yeah that's what we did right and decided to sever the hand oh Yeah, let's do this. Helping hand. Yeah, it's kind of neat how it shows each chapter as an old VHS uh, tape. Disinfections. Stop the disinfection spreading. Yep. Okay. Distraction. View your path. Hunter poured blood over Jacob's face. Ryan heard rustling in the woods. Mm -hmm. Jacob avoided detection. Jacob was captured. Okay, so it doesn't necessarily tell you what the any sort of outcome. Would no, be it just shows you path. what your paths were and what okay. you chose to do exactly. Yeah. Awesome. Okay. Well, this one has been this one, guys, has really been sucking me in. The addition of bringing Laura back has to be the biggest surprise that I didn't see coming, as well as her coming back looking like uh, Solid Snake himself or. Uh, you know, with the eye patch and everything, or Snake Pliskin from Escape from New York, one of my favorites. But uh, this is awesome. I'm feeling pretty good that we haven't necessarily lost anybody, uh, except Nick, I guess you could say, is kind of gone. Um, well, and Max, obviously, from the beginning, but I'm not sure if Nick was unavoidable or not. I don't recall if there was anything that we missed, QTE-wise, or decisions that we made that might have affected that. So, um I guess we'll just have to wait and find out and see what uh, the quarry has to bring us. Yeah, you know, it was interesting when we did Until Dawn. Um, it wasn't until 
you know, we got closer to the end where we learned that there was just a multitude of different outcomes, mm -hmm. some that saved everybody mm -hmm. and some where everybody perished and then everything in between. So now, of course, coming into the quarry, not really knowing, and I've, I've stayed away from YouTube videos on this. So mm -hmm. it's, it's an interesting thing about yeah. the channel is that when we've come into new games, um, we'll take Hogwarts and Red Dead Redemption 2, for example, um, there's, as you guys know, a billion videos on YouTube, tips and tricks you knew your first, wish you knew, top 10 things to do when you start. Um, but my concern about those types of videos is that they're, all, regardless of whether they're meant to be spoiler free, they're always giving away a little bit of spoilers. Right. And there's some things that you would like to learn for yourself. But like we found, some of the games have tutorials, but you have to learn further than that. Yeah. Um, so we haven't watched any uh, i haven't watched anything. no i haven't we watched have anything on any the youtube videos on the quarry yet so i don't know up to this point if there's a way that nick could have been saved or if that's part of the story development but aside from nick we have everybody alive at this point yeah I mean, um, we saved abby i i feel we saved her because we saw the tarot card of her getting her head peeled and that yeah, didn't happen there, and so. that didn't happen so i think had we not you know, pulled the trigger. Now I missed the one QTE, but I don't know. See, some of the QTEs feel like they advance the story, and some feel like they they may be um, non consequential. But it's hard to say. Uh, yeah. And so again, we're trying to avoid as many spoilers as we can. But this has been so much fun. If I'm being honest, and maybe because it's just because I feel a little bit more comfortable with the game. I am preferring this one uh, until over until dawn mm. a little bit. I know a lot of people said that until dawn was was better than the quarry, but of course the term better is going to be completely subjective with these games. And for me, this feels again the summer camp. Um, you know, I grew up in in the '80s, so of course Friday the Thirteenth <laughs> summer camps. You know, the sheriff. It feels like a mix of Friday the Thirteenth, Texas Chainsaw Massacre, and then you throw in some some legendary stuff with yep. the uh, with, with the werewolves. werewolves. So. It, it feels like a retro throwback so but then again um you know until dawn had some some classic you know the teens yeah. visiting the cabin you know so like a trick a prank somebody got mad almost like a carry vibe yeah know. these have both been a lot of fun and i think you know we're, we've taken a little bit different approach to this game mm -hmm. in attempt to keep people alive oh i, I know think. there was so many times i wanted to be more aggressive with the sheriff because yeah. i was like well this is what I'm feeling versus right. what I feel I should do to properly advance the story. And I think that's but, where sometimes they get you a little bit. Yeah, you know, it's an interesting. And that's, the one thing that I love about this game is that you can go back through. So I'm 100% going to go back through and play this again, whether it be with my brothers or my fiance. I love the idea of a couch co-op. Mm -hmm. um, I don't know if you can do the couch co-op yet online remotely with different people in different locations so help us out in that of course i can google it but you know what it's more fun to read it in the comments if there's anybody else out there who does play couch co-op and i might have thrown this out in the last one i just i don't remember if i saw a response to it but if you do couch co-op be it this game or other games um let us know if that's something where you know somebody else on an xbox can play couch co-op with you remotely but again a lot of fun i really love this is the way this is developing it was interesting when uh, mason quinn and i um so for our, our our last episode we decided to try to play a couch you know, co-op type game for the first one our initial one um we just you were handing the controller back and forth yeah. kind of as it switched characters mm -hmm. but it was just every other uh, a lot of people had recommended couch co-op from what we saw, there wasn't really an option to go back and start over yeah, like that. Change the game. So we just control. assigned ourselves characters. And mm -hmm. it was interesting when we assigned ourselves <laughs> characters. And I said, Laura, isn't she, is she, isn't gone? she gone? But there's there's no Max. So we did a little bit of a spoiler there. Um, but to come back in this sort of capacity is, is really cool. So um, a lot of fun. Can't wait for the next one. But keep the comments rolling in. We really appreciate it. And uh, we're going to... We're gonna keep finding Lots out how surprises. this story goes. We have the other thing is we have no idea. We're on chapter five. I didn't check how many chapters. Yeah, which there were. is maybe good that we didn't because you know that's always the tricky thing we deal with as you know content creators trying to give you guys something interesting to watch is we have to kind of stay away. I think from some of the tips and the tricks and different things like that because otherwise we would know some things and 
for me personally, I, I know it's a little bit more difficult and, and tougher and we see it with Red Dead with some of the problems I have and, and that with just figuring I things out. Us, but I yeah. think it's more fun to go in and not knowing anything and just being blown away by this this whole new world that we're in and uh, here in Hackett's Quarry. So Yeah, yeah. Even with Red Dead, I look, we, we had some problems with Red Dead. We, we really did. And so that was one where... Um, in the interest of being able to continue quality content and, and, and be halfway decent at it, we watched a ton of YouTube videos. And now we're running into some people who are like, oh yeah, I remember this from the YouTube video. So there were tutorials, but kind of like spoilers. So unless yeah. we really struggle with something, um, it's kind of a we'd rather learn as we go yep. type thing. So that's where we're at right now. This game I think we're doing pretty well with, but man, this is, this, oh, this is so much fun in this whole world. Uh, this whole world of choose your own adventure, you know, cinema style games, I'm just completely fascinated with because I had never played these before, before Detroit Become Human. And I don't believe Mason Quinn had mm -hmm. either. And I think it's such a neat concept and just so much fun. And we are, trust me, we are going to be doing a lot of these yeah, you kinds folks of games. Gave us a lot of recommendations, some Ton different ones for us to check out so you can count on it. We'll be hitting those. All right, but for uh that's that's gonna be it for this episode. So for myself, the Appleton Oak, Mason Quinn, that's another wrap for the quarry on Bad Medicine Arcade. We'll check you on the next one. Be sure to bring those quarters. <laughs>